Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be an unboxing. Um, I have my beauty boxes here. Let me explain. I know you didn't get one in September. Um, that's because I got sent my birch box and my look fantastic box didn't come. Well, it did come. They sent me the same one again and I didn't think you guys would want to see the same stuff again as the stuff you saw in August. So I kept a hold of my birch box and I kept saying, I'll do it when my new look fantastic one comes because they promised me they'd send out another one. This isn't a ranty video. Um, at first I was going to do a ranty video because I was getting really bad service from them and long story short I found out that they lied to me and they didn't actually have the box in stock anymore so the three times that I called their customer service to ask where my box was and they kept saying that they'd sent it they didn't actually send it because they didn't have any in stock. So I was really really angry I was ready to come on here and tell you guys about my experience um, I would never tell somebody where they can and can't shop but I think it helps if you guys know a good and bad experience so that you can judge for yourself where, whether or not you want to go with them um, so I was gonna come on here and share my story with you guys but then one last time I called up their customer service and I was like let me speak to a manager because I'm really 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 angry and I spoke to a manager and before I could even get my words out she was like, oh, we've refunded you the box and we've given you some store credit as well. So I was like, oh, okay. So now I kind of feel kind of okay. I'm still not gonna renew my box because they kind of let me down, put it into perspective. I've been with Birchbox for nearly three years and they've never once missed a box or let me down in any way. Look fantastic, I've been with for nine months and all this happened, so, you know. Um, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not considering renewing. Um, I'm thinking about doing some different boxes because I'm not, I might not renew with them and I might not renew the Birch Box because I've been with Birch Box for three years. I want to see what else is out there, you know, see if there's any box. Do I want to stay with Birch Box? Do I want to try something else? So, anyway, so this time around I have two Birch Boxes because I have September and October. And I have the October Look Fantastic box. Oh, so let's do September first. September's Birch box was with the artist uh, Oliver Bonas, Bonas, something. He um, designed the box, and you could get um, if you paid extra, you could get this print like as a piece of artwork as well. I'm not really that way inclined, so I didn't do that. But in your box you do get some stickers that were made by him as well. So I have already opened these because as I said I've had this one for well since the beginning of September so um, so in here I, I had an eye cream which was I'm going to show you the thing it was this eye cream here which is the Polar Icy Magic Instant Eye Contour Energizer. Um, retail price of £22. It was just a sample size um, and it's like a roller bowl. You roll it under your eyes and it's supposed to moisturise. The reason I don't have it is because I actually already had one. So I gave this one to a friend who was looking for an eye cream. Um, and my one I depotted, so I can't really show that to you either. That's that. That's the first item, um, and all the rest of the items are untouched, maybe swatched. Um, so I have this. This is the Rouge Bunny Rouge. Uh, that's not English. Number sixty-five, as if it were summer still. Bronzing glow liquid miniature. And this is a. It's like a liquid bronzer, but if you blend it out, then it becomes like a. you know, just for, well, bronzing, but like you can, you can use it as a, bro like a bronzing primer. So it comes out like that. And you can smush it like that. But then if you completely blend it out, bearing in mind it was a lot to put on my hand, you kind of, it just, 
just bronzes the skin ever so slightly. So if you want a bronzy look, you can use it as a bronzer, like a liquid bronzer, or you can just use it as a, like a bronzy primer. Um, so looking forward to using that. I've never tried a liquid bronzer before and it smells nice too. Um, I also have this Manicada Beauty eyeshadow. It doesn't say the shade. Oh, it's called Fantasy and it's a three in one blush, highlighter and eyeshadow. I would never use this as a blush. I would never use it as a highlighter. I would use it as an eyeshadow. Uh, you can see I've swatched it already. Um, but I can see on some people, it would look, you can really see where it's highlighting, like in the light. But it's way too deep for me to use as a highlighter. I'm going to swatch it on my arm because the tanning stuff is on my... Um, I could maybe use it as a blush topper, but never as a highlight. Like, it would be a beautiful eyeshadow. And you can really, really, really see the sheen. I know you can't really so well on camera, but it would work really well for some people as a highlighter. Um, for me, it's probably more of a blush topper, you know, when I don't, I say when I don't want to put a highlight on. I always want to put a highlight on. Um, I have the Dr. Pawpaw Original Balm, multi-purpose soothing balm with natural pawpaw. And this is for lips, skin, cuticles, and beauty finishing. And it is fragrance free. It is fragrance free. And it's like a gel, uh, like a gel cream. And it just sinks into the skin, kind of silicone -y. It has no scent, as they, as they say. Um, this is the, it's just a sachet. It is the Body Chirp Hair Mask. Pour pure oil blend, 100% natural, single treatment. I am the 100% natural softness hair mask. My pure oils are specially formulated to hydrate, nourish, and repair dry, tired, and damaged hair. I restore natural strength, shine, and silkiness, leaving your hair as soft as a feather. Apply to dry hair and scalp, leave to absorb for 25 minutes, shampoo hair twice thoroughly, and condition if desired. Dry and style as normal. Say hello to other softer, to softer, revitalized hair. Um, and the oils that it has in it is coconut, grapeseed oil, castor oil, olive oil, argan oil, jojoba oil, avocado oil, grapefruit oil, bergamot oil, lemon oil, tea tree, uh, and ylang ylang. Um, so yeah, that's definitely a lot of oils. Really, all of those really good for your hair. So I'm looking forward to trying that. Um, and that was the September birch box. As I said, my look fantastic for September didn't come. So we will talk about the August birch box, the October birch box. And this just looks like this. This is really pretty. I love this box. And this box, I believe, was in. Uh, yeah, so it's the breast cancer one, and it's called Feeling Good. Um, and there are some things in here about breast cancer. So you've got, um, to show your appreci our appreciation, we're giving you £10 off your next order from Birchbox Shop. Just spend £50 and enter the code. Um, offer ends 17th of November. So, don't know if this is just for me. Maybe everyone got these. I don't know if it's an original code or not. I'll link it down below. If it's a one use only, I'm not going to use it. So might as well give it a go. If it says this, that it's already been redeemed, then sorry, someone got there first. But I don't. I wouldn't have thought something they'd send out in a box would be one use only. Like surely they'd send the same thing to everyone. And this is just a sticker that you can put wherever you want, and it just goes like shows you the steps to check your breasts for breast cancer. Oh, there's something else in here. Oh, and that's just a card with the same thing on it to carry around with you. Okay, so, you know, I've said it before, I'll say it again. Birchbox, you get your one item that you get to pick. This time it was between a contour stick, which I thought would have been too dark for me, seeing as I have really pale skin, or a mascara. 
and I needed a new mascara because the one I'm using is getting down there. So that's what the wand, you can't see that because that's in the way, that's what the wand looks like. So it's a nice sleek wand, it's actually similar to ones that I've preferred using before, you know, the spikies. Um, so I'm looking forward to trying that. This is by Model Co and it is the Mega Lash High Definition Mascara in Black. And another makeup item in this box, I have the Ico by L Ico London Skinny Liquid Eyeliner in Black. And it's just a felt tip eyeliner. And that's like super pigmented, like. That's seriously pigmented. I suck at doing a wing, like I really suck at doing a wing and it does not suit me. But what I can do is I can use this to like, just, just by my lashes, like not quite a wing, but not my, not my top line either just like on my lid where my lashes are just to make them look a little bit fuller I can use that I also had the sorry I took it out of its packet this is the eco tools sponge um, it's for contour so that's why it's on the thing um, somebody tell me if I'm supposed to use this wet or not let me know because I can't find any information anywhere that tells me um, I have the Balance Me Pure Skin Face Wash, 99% natural, um, a sulfate-free cleanser designed to purify, refresh, and gently balance, not strip away the skin's natural protective barriers. Enhances radiance and tone. And the last item is the Anatom Anatomicals Boob Tube Grab Your Melons Shower Gel. Um, of all the things you should keep abreast of, news, current affairs, celebrity gossip, don't forget your breasts. Every year, 55,000 people are diagnosed with breast cancer, 10% of them late. So while feeling the enlivening benefits of this melon, what else, cleanser, give your boobs a jolly good feel. And remember, where your health is concerned, another touch is never a touch too much. So, um, and this product's like, if you buy this then all the funds go to the charity Copperfield. And it smells like melons, that smells amazing. And that was October's Birch Box. Okay, October's Look Fantastic Box is just by here. It is the Indulge Me Box. I really like the packaging on this one. And it says Nourish to Flourish on the inside. Get rid of the junk. Okay, so the first item is this. This is the Bean Body Coffee Bean Scrub uh, with skin loving coconut oil, vitamin E, and sea salt. Um, I've learnt to not enjoy coffee scrubs. We discussed this in a previous video. I much prefer scrubs that dissolve or break down when I'm using them, like sea, uh, sea salt or sugar. Um, stuff with coffee or shell of like coconuts or whatever um it doesn't break down so much and i find them too harsh for my skin so what i'm going to do is i will pass this on to my brother's girlfriend i have the mono skin affirming fiji face facial oil for dry or sensitive skin and it's with rose and patchouli all you need to tone and firm tired or dehydrated skin. After cleansing and toning, warm in the palm of the hands and massage into the skin using gentle upward movements. Um, I have a sheet mask here. Oh, it's for hands. Um, eradicates dryness, refines skin texture, restores softness, brightness and even skin tone. And it is the Skimono Beauty Mask. Intense nourishment, a revitalizing serum enriched with shea butter, aloe vera, and hyaluronic acid in an innovative glove mask. I have the Lancer the Polish. Um, this is the exfoliant from the three step by Lancer. I do enjoy this. Um, I like the cleanser. There's this one, there's the cleanser and the moisturizer. 
and I really, really enjoyed these when I had a, like a, oh, it's sealed. Um, when I had a sachet sample, but I looked at the price of them and it was just like ridiculous. I think for all three things was over a hundred pounds. So I wasn't going to buy that. So I'm glad I've got the sample. And I have the Ciate London Wonder Wand Mascara. I'm not going to open it because I opened that last one. So that one I need to be used up first. Um, but now I have two mascaras when I needed one. So that's handy. I didn't have to spend any money. Although having said that, that means that I still can't get the Urban Decay Trouble Maker Mascara. So that's a bit of a bummer. And I have this. This is the Model Co Instant Radiance. I'm guessing it's a kind of concealer. doesn't actually say. It might say in the instructions actually. In, in the instructions. In the booklet. see that it's gone like straight up that's so weird okay it's a very thick concealer maybe I used too much it just all came off all of a sudden that's like it's almost a little bit too dark. Well, a little bit goes a long way. Hmm, it might be okay. Well, you can't see it if I do. Well, you can see it. It's just a little, it's a touch too dark. Or maybe it's a touch too yellow. Mm, I see if I can make it work. If not, then I'll probably pass that on to my brother's girlfriend as well. Um, and that's everything that was in that box. Thank you for joining me in my opening. Um, oh. Yeah. Uh, oh, so what I did was I cancelled my birch box uh, because the reason I can I cancelled my birch box I cancelled it because I wanted to try a different box. I've been with them for a long time, as I said, and I wanted to try something new. So I've signed up for glossy box. So next month's boxes for November will be the look fantastic. And a glossy box, not a birch box. So watch out for that one. We'll see if glossy box is any good. Um, and that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care. See you soon. Bye.